Peggy 18. platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. Platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. Platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. I need to cut the platform loose. an explosion to raise the platform. I need to create an explosion to raise the platform. I need to create an explosion to raise the platform. I need to create an explosion to raise the platform. I need to create an explosion to raise the platform. Oh shit! <clears throat> I need to climb to reach that beam. 
climb to reach that beam. I need to climb to reach that beam. I need to climb to reach that beam. to reach that beam. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
All full up. Can't carry any more. There's the next cross. All full up. Can't carry any more. Looks like there's something here. Wait, I can push this. Got it! I don't have enough space for that. God! There you are. Yes. Who are you? Guillermo sent me to find you. He's worried about you. <sighs> Poor Guillermo. He's probably killing himself with guilt, too. <laughs> I guess we were both right. There was a hidden crypt, and I did have an idealized view of what it would be like. How did you injure yourself? I was on a rope when the tremor hit. The shaking threw me into the walls, the rope snapped, and I hit the water badly. Uh, I think my ankle's broken. In order to get you out, I'll have to go back for help. It will take several people. <laughs> What's so funny? 
Can one of those people be Sarah? I'd love to see the look on her face when she has to admit that one of Manu's fantastic stories turned out to be true. I'll suggest it to Guillermo. Now, I don't think I can get out the way I came in, so I'm gonna have to look for another way out. I'll be right back. And I'll be right here. I've always been grateful for my vivid imagination, except for right now. I can't wait to get out. It was me, don't worry. I must be on the right path. The air is getting fresher. Don't tease me. I've spent the night in a crypt.
Isabella, I see daylight. You'll be out of here in no time. You're amazing. Thank you so much. Full up. Can't carry any more. Please, tell me Isabella's okay. She is, but she's hurt her ankle, so we'll have to go back and get her. No, I could not stand to inconvenience you any further. And besides, Sarah tells me you have something important of your own to do. Please, let Isa's friends take care of her from here. You'll need a couple of people and a lot of rope to get her out. I'll round them up right away. Where is she exactly? Take the main road across the river, then follow the crosses. Wait, the crosses? Did she find something? She found the crypt Manu told her about. She did? That's wonderful. Oh, I, I'm so happy for her. I should have gone with her, and I feel terrible about her ankle. But despite that, this is the adventure Isa's always dreamed of. She also suggested that maybe Sarah could be a member of her rescue party. Oh, that's a great idea. I'll make sure of it. And speaking of Manu and his crazy stories, if you're looking for something hidden around here, you should probably talk to him. It worked for Isa. He's usually hoarding coal around the mission. And thank you again for finding Isabella. I don't know what I would have done if... Just make sure she gets back safe. Even Maya ruins. You must family. be Manu. Who's that? Who's there? She's the one who found the treasure. Is that right, Diego? Well, well, what can I do for you? I overheard you telling the children about Maya ruins. Finally, someone who pays attention. Well, you were right about the crosses. Isabella followed them to a hidden crypt. Ha! I knew it, I knew it. No one ever listens to old Manu, but I was right. <sighs> so you were. And I bet you're telling the truth about those Maya ruins. I recognize something in your voice. The thrill of discovery, of finding something, some place unseen for hundreds or even thousands of years. There is something thrilling about that, isn't there? There's no feeling like it. The taste of stale, dusty air still gets my heart racing. These modern people, these so-called realists, they close themselves off from such wondrous possibilities. They can't even imagine some of the things I've seen. Ah, that I would give anything to see again one last time. Perhaps I could be your eyes, your witness of those Maya ruins. You could at that, yes. Do you remember where the ruins were? Now where were they? 
I remember a pool fed by three waterfalls. Uh, I wish I could give you better directions, but it's been so many years. I should be able to find it. And when I do, I'll come back and tell you all about it. Oh, if you could do that for me. Touch that, that history. I would... I would be so... Say no more, Manu. I'll find it. I hope you've shined up those dancing shoes, Manu. I found the ruin. It was Maya, an ancient aqueduct. It was wonderful, just as you'd imagined. I knew you would! Now, tell me everything. The ruins had flooded because of the earthquake. I swam through tunnels teeming with peril. Go on. I found a vast cavern and a stone tower with massive heads carved into its sides. The Lords of Shibalba, right? Incredible. What else? It must have been an aqueduct of some kind. And you'll never believe this. Most of the machinery is still functional. Water wheels, three men high, turned as smoothly as the day they were built. It was amazing to see Manu, to be so close to all that history where no one has set foot in hundreds of years. <laughs> I see it. I can smell it, feel it, taste it. You've brought tears to an old man's dry eyes. I, I can't thank you enough. I I'd like to give you something. Manu, I, I couldn't. Please, I insist. It's the first relic I ever found. It's beautiful and intricate. A decorated skull. I'd like someone who has the same passion for exploring that I did as a young man to have it. Don't ever let anything kill your sense of curiosity and wonder. I won't. Thank you, Manu. Feels like a mausoleum. Mm, means we're on the right track, right? Jonah, I feel something. We're getting close. Let's look around for signs of Lopez. <clears throat> and under his wings you may seek refuge. Under his wings. These notes were written by the founder of the Sisters. They're talking about funds allocated for renovations to the library. be darkened and the moon will not give its light. Jonah, those two Bible quotes. The sun will be darkened and under his wings you may seek refuge. What does it mean? That's it. Look for a heron and an eclipse. Años. Un 
paso a la vez. Y a la vez. Como si tuviéramos. The others are worried that there's a whole mural under here. <coughs> Cruz, the true cross. Is that what I think it is? The silver box. It's unmistakable. Jesus takes up the cross. These are the stations of the cross. But there's a bunch missing. Before 1600, there were only seven. This could date back to the time of Lopez. This is one of his clues. Yeah. It's the kind of thing he does. All right. Let's see if we can find a cross lying around here somewhere. When we find the box, how do we get the key back from the Dominguez? We'll find a way. Found something? Yeah. Jesus takes up the cross. Help me lift this. <laughs> a long way down. Let's see where this leads. Two. Jesus falls the first time. There's an inscription here. Ambulate dum lucem habitis. Walk while you have the light. That did it. I wouldn't want to be buried in here. My head tossed behind a cross somewhere. Walk while you have the light, so that the darkness may not overtake you. Sounds like a hint. Or a threat. This looks like the Virgin Mary. Station 3. Jesus meets his mother. The mirror looks dusty. I'll give you a boost.
Hey, it worked. The light leads this way. <sighs> what happened to these people? It looks like the light activated something. Laura! Are you alright? You're lucky it was a little rusted. <sighs> this must be Station 4. Yeah. Let's have Hong to direct the light beam towards the fresco of Veronica. These people look like they were tortured. Hung up in the ceiling. I don't think this was just a crypt. Or they were just sick. This must be Station 6. I'll need to direct the left light beam toward the crucifixion scene. Looks like a church. These ones are posed like monks. Uh-huh. I think this was a place of worship for an underground sect. This, this is the second one. I'll need to Then the Romans drive in the nails. Good. This is disgusting. I'm glad I wasn't the rabbit Lopez was. I'll need to direct the left light beam toward the scene of Jesus being nailed to the cross. Don't let Lopez get in your head. It's caused enough trouble in that Only the hands of the Righteous One may seize destiny from mine. I guess it's you then. He led us on this goose chase. He sabotaged every clue. All to keep this box from Trinity. And the people of Paititi. Was totally consumed by it.
Where is she? I don't know. I just need the box. Fuck you! Well, I guess we're done here. Release him, and I will give you the box. Laura, what are you doing? I've lost enough people. <laughs> I know you have. Your father was brilliant. He was taken from me before I could know. He was my friend. But he was obsessed relentlessly. You didn't know him. He refused to see the potential for destruction in his work. He had to be stopped. You had him killed. He was going to lead the public to Paititi. Everything I love, everything I fought for. My world would have been destroyed. And what about my world? You can't think it's the same. It is to a nine-year-old girl. I was a child. There was too much at stake. An entire civilization, hundreds of years of independence, thousands of lives. I had no choice. There's always a choice. It's not too late. You can honor Unaratu and restore the sun. No. The threat must be removed. You're a low, selfish, murdering coward. And you, Lara, how many lives have you ended? Hmm? In pursuit of what? Laura, go! Stop him! Past just now? Yeah. Think we should call him? Hell no. God, God, he's hunting us. You don't look so good.
This is Rourke. Jonah Maeva has the box, and Lara Croft was last seen in the church. Find them! They just left her alone in the church. It was chaos! You aren't looking too good. Jonah, where are you? I'm in the cane field. They can't see me. Keep your head down. I'm on my way. All units, priority one, find Lara Croft. You heard the commander. Let's go hunting. Croft, I know you're out there. I should have killed you in Siberia, but Dominguez was against it. That's on me. But I'm gonna fix that mistake, now. You don't look so good. Shit! Yeah.
Cardinal Six, we've got visual on Croft. He's at the distillery. Deacon team, deploy. Deacon's on the ground, Commander. Let's get her. Got this.
How much longer to pay TT? Almost there. I'm sorry I lost the box. It's not your fault. It's... It's Dominguez. It's Trinity. All the way back, as far as I can remember, it's always been them. I could have had a family. Everything could have been different. We will get the box, and we will stop Dominguez. Your Highness. Lara. Where, where is the box? Amaru has it. But the death of the sun draws near. We'll get it back before he completes the ritual. This will not be easy. We'll have to adjust the plan. Please, take your time to prepare yourself. We'll gather intelligence and fighters. Thank you. I'll stay here and lend Uchu a hand. Let me know if you need anything. Okay. 